welcome back to my channel if you guys are new welcome to my channel yo soy lali la Huera. welcome to my channel guys and welcome back again i hope you guys are doing fantastic and you guys are having a great start to the summer um so for today's video it's been long gone waiting for um i am going to do a summer western clothes haul idea try on type video for you guys whatever you guys want to call it because i have no idea there's so many names of what to call it but i am back with another video guys and i'm so excited to be here filming another video for you guys it's been long overdue that i needed to come back and i am so so happy that i have all new more subscribers and all the subscribers that have been here since the beginning i am obviously not famous and i am obviously far from <laughs> where i want to be but i appreciate everyone that's here watching my videos and that continues to do so um so yeah guys so if you guys want to stick around and see some summer western outfit ideas rodeo ideas it's gonna be a little mix of of outfits so if you guys are looking for an outfit for a wedding you want to go western or a quinceanera you want to go western or just a nice day out in the summer you want to go western if you guys are going to charreadas jaripeos coleaderos aquí va a haber de todo but i that being said I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys haven't already, subscribe to my channel if you have not. And yeah, guys, if you guys like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. And let's get started. Quick disclaimer, really quick. Um, I'm going to be trying to mention all the stores and all the boutiques that I got all my pieces from and um, from my outfits. If I do not mention them in the video, guys, I completely am so sorry. Um, I, one, I might have forgotten where I got in it from, and two, if I don't mention it, I will try to look for the store that I got, uh, my item from, and I will link it in the video so you guys know where I got it from. So yeah, guys, let's get started with the first outfit. Alright, guys, so this is the first outfit. It's a little dressy, little casual. It's kind of in between, but I'll go from the top. I have these... Uh, rustic um, reddish gold earrings that I paired with it because it matches the belt and I paired it with this as well ignore my hairy arms my dad is very hairy and that's where I get the genetic from <laughs> um, but and then after that I got this leopard print dress it's kind of bluish like blue baby bluish gray with white um, it's a little shorter from the front and then it's longer from the back it's super cute i got this actually from my birthday um i i they got it from buckle i got this as a birthday present and it's super cute i really love it and i paired it from and i paired it with my belt um area belt with my avia avia from avia <laughs> um and then i paired it with these boots um these boots that i got from boot barn very casual and uh very like um you can match it with a lot of things because they are very simple and they're just brown so this is the outfit very simple very cute i really like this outfit and then i just paired it with like the necklaces that i always wear my horseshoe with my love necklace these my parents both got for me um so you guys this is the outfit cute and simple for like a birthday party or something but yeah let's go to the next outfit all right guys so this is the next outfit it's very very similar to the first one well, not all that similar but the similar concept and style of what i wanted to go for another s simple dress outfit they could wear for birthday party well not a birthday party or like a wedding or something wherever you want to go a little bit more dressy western um actually kind of wore a similar outfit to uh, a bautizo um and actually wore this exact same dress but i kind of changed it up a little bit so i'll start from the bottom this time i have my area boots it has a little color of that blue and i thought it would look really nice with uh the blue in the dress um, and then the dress I got from Shein, although it is a bit different. Um, the dress, 
well this is the dress I got from Shein but it came out longer so I just cut it a little bit up further up so it wasn't too long but it still has that slit in it as well and I paired it with the same belt and I paired it with these uh concho not concho um but these white earrings that I don't remember where I got actually and then similar bracelet to the earrings and yeah I actually wore um my brown grizzly with this the day of the batiso just to kind of zazz it up a little bit um but yeah guys this is the next outfit it's a cute simple dressy yeah dressy and casual western oh yeah hey guys this is the outfit i hope you guys like it but yeah let's move on to the next all right guys so this is the next outfit it's casual and dressy at the same time but i i don't know it's different i really like it um but yeah so i'll start from the bottom again so i use the same boots that i did in the same outfit the ones that i got from boot barn these are actually idle wind boots i really really like them very nice like i said you can wear oh my god like I said, I really, really like them. Um, they are very versatile, and this is why I like them, because you can match them with literally everything. And then this uh, flowery, uh, like, greenish, bluish um, skirt, half slit. It's a, very, it's a lot longer than the other than other ones I have used, but I really like it. It's super cute. I actually used this on my 21st birthday. Um, on my birthday party actually um and i got this from Shein. i really really like their slit skirts i think they're super cute and you can almost wear them with anything and then i matched it with the same belt my go-to belt and then with this shirt that says waiting on love with little horse and i got this shirt a really really long time ago at dear rodeo um so yeah that's one of the boutiques i have a discount code with so i will leave it down below in the description box they actually are coming out with new items so if you guys want to check it out most definitely make sure to do so um so yeah just this cute tee that i paired with it and then this long horn necklace that i actually made myself i made it a while ago and it's kind of like sad and broken down i need to add some stuff to it again and then just the same earrings that i paired with my last outfit i don't remember where i got these from so i would have to look into that and then just the same bracelet it's this one and then i added this one on this side with the ones from mexico um but yeah guys this is outfit number three hope you guys like it it's a bit different versatile i i definitely played around with it a little bit but i think it's really cute a little simple casual dressy but yeah guys this is the this outfit really cute but yeah guys let me know what you guys think and which one is your favorite all right guys so this is the next outfit first hold on pause let me tell you guys a little bit about this outfit so this outfit is very casual this is like we're going out, but we're going to go out casual, western, maybe like a club, not a club, what am I saying? Like a bar or something where you just hang out with your girls and you're like, you know, we're going western casual. Like, very casual. So, but not so casual because, you know, you want to spice it up with your jewelry or whatever. Uh, so let me first tell you guys about my earrings. So these I got a while ago. They're my French conch fringe concho earrings a little turquoise moment um i got these at spirit western um they are a local uh business here in illinois uh and i do have a discount code for them with them so if you guys want to check them out they are coming out with um cowhide handbags made at homemade handbags so if you guys want to check those out i would definitely definitely um check those out if you guys can and then i paired it with this um squash ball some um turquoise necklace that i love it's my all-time favorite um this one's from cattle blossom actually so i have a discount code with them now i am one of their pr uh girls um so i will leave my um discount code down below as well so you guys can go shop with them i love them they're amazing and i love all their jewelry as well 
and then I paired it with this earring, turquoise earring, and then my promise ring, obviously. And then this other turquoise earring that I got actually both from Shein. And I paired it with this cowhide bracelet that I also got from Spirit Western. And then this other one that I got at a Western store in the mall. So, you guys, let me show you the rest of the outfit. Alright, guys, so this is the rest of the outfit. I got this uh, rustic reddish, love this shirt, um t-shirt that i got from um lk here in illinois and then i paired them with these cute uh like jeans they got like little um like little stuff white cute stuff with some ribs distress on them that i really like they're straight they kind of flare out when well, they don't really flare out but they're straight and then i paired them with um my cowhide chunk glass but yeah i got these actually for my birthday as well and i got them from buckle as well so you guys this is like a little simple cute outfit you know you're going out you want to be dressy but very very casual so yeah guys let me know what you think i think this is one of my favorites i really like it super cute super simple but yeah let me know what you guys think you guys like this outfit um i have a few more outfits to show you guys so let's continue with the video Alright guys, so this outfit, I'm going to explain it a little bit to you guys. This outfit is going to be for all my coleadero girls and for all the haripeo and for all the charreada girls that be going to the charreadas, be going to Herradura Sundays. <laughs> That's funny. And all uh, the, um, you know, all the ranchos that everybody be going to here in Illinois or in Texas or in California anywhere you are at oklahoma like anywhere denver i know they'd be having their coleaderos there too but yeah guys so this is just a little outfit inspo i'm not saying that my outfits are cute this is personally one i actually wore to one uh a couple weeks ago or a week or so ago um but that was my first uh charria that i actually went to since covid um i'm so happy because i missed those days but yeah guys um very simple i actually wore my straw hat with it but i'm not gonna show it in this video you can wear it with any hat you want girls if people tell you not to wear hats no les hagas caso porque mi hija tú en lo que tú te quieres poner y si tú te sientes segura y cómoda y bonita hermosa Preciosa, tú póntelo. No dejes que nadie te diga que no te puedes poner una tejana o, o un sombrero o nada. Porque si a ti te gusta, póntelo. ¿Qué importa lo que diga la gente? But yeah, guys. Enough with my spiel. Here is the next outfit. Let me show you. Oh my god, guys. I wish I had better lighting in my room. But this is the next outfit. Um, like I said, your typical... Uh, charriada uh, coleadero outfit so from the top I just paired it with some uh, the concho earrings that I had in the other outfit and then this concho necklace just to zhuzh it up a bit <laughs> what is me in that word and then just this cute simple blouse top that I got at Discovery honestly guys you can find a lot of these tops there at Discovery to wear for a simple outfit like this and then my go to bell with some area jeans Boots and then I got my ugly ranch boots because you know if you're going to one of those events, why are you gonna wear nice boots? Because obviously they're gonna get dirty. So you guys, this is the outfit. Hope you guys like it. It's really cute, simple for a rodeo, charreada, coledero, wherever you are going, horse race, whatever, or wherever it doesn't have to be necessary for that. It could be for wherever you want to wear it to, even a party. We never know my life if you if you like if you're comfy in jeans. But you guys, this is this outfit. I have a couple more that I'm gonna show you guys for the same occasion. So you guys, let's continue. Alright guys, so this outfit is ultimately very similar to the other outfit because again it's for like charriadas, um coleadero type outfit, rodeo outfit. Um, so yeah guys, it's very simple, similar to the other outfit with another cute blouse. This is like, um, a leopard kind of print blouse, I think. It's like dark brown and off-white, again with my ranch dirty boots. And then with my area jeans, um, and then I paired with the same buckle. 
And then this shirt I got at Discovery. No, no, no. I got at Marshalls. This top I got at Marshalls. So you can also find cute tops like that. And then I just paired it with my little necklace that I made. I don't remember where I got this pendant from though. Um, and then again, my earrings. And I paired it with these little rustic turquoise earrings just to kind of pop out the outfit. Give it a bit of a color. But yeah guys, this is this outfit. Please ignore my mess in the back. Just organizing the outfits. But yeah guys, this is this outfit. And I hope you guys like it. But yeah guys. Alright guys, so that was the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and all the outfits that I shared with you guys today. There were a couple and of course there's going to be more to come if you guys want to see more outfits and western outfits and how to style them or what to style with them. But yeah guys, just a little bit of my kind of um the way I kind of dress and how I put my outfits together. Everyone has different style, everyone has different ways and unique ways of putting their outfits together. So yeah guys, let me know what outfit you guys liked and what other videos you guys would like to see from me. Most definitely, I am going to be filming this summer. I am so excited. I have so much time and I am going to dedicate a lot of time to filming for you guys this summer and I can't wait. Um, if you guys like this video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed yet, please subscribe if you guys want to see more of my content. And yeah guys, thank you guys for being here. I appreciate it so, so much and I'll see you guys in the next video. Adios!